Yes.
3-1 win against uh, High Flying Herne Bay and uh, what uh, three goals were wonderful weren't they? Uh, yeah, I, mean, I think it was a really good performance. I mean, you know, obviously we had a good result on Friday, a uh, good performance. Uh, made some changes which might surprise a few people but you know while we're here we, we, we've got to have a look at different things and so on and so forth. So, and I think that's been well documented now. So yeah, a few changes. Um, but you know, I thought first half we uh, we passed the ball really well, created lots of um, some good moments in possession, um, one or two good chances, and yeah, I mean the, the goals were great, great, great finish from from Big Tom, um, who you know, arguably like probably too good a footballer to be a centre half. I think uh, <laughs> can see him going a little bit higher up the pitch at some point. Uh, but yeah, look. You know, he took his goal brilliantly. Uh, great strike from um, from young Josh Bayliss, yeah. the young never got from Jules. I'm looking forward to seeing that on the high. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yes, yeah. am I? <laughs> um, and really, then at two 0 we, we were we were cruising to a certain degree, and then like for a, we had a little spell last five minutes of the first half where we lost a little bit of concentration. They changed shape for the second time, so they 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 went from a, a the same as us to a diamond, and then they ended up going to a three. Uh, and they started to be a little bit more direct and that caused us a few problems. So uh, yeah. we conceded a goal, 2-1, then changes the game slightly. Yeah, so kind of happened when we had that injury, didn't it? Yeah, it did. Yeah, when Harrison went off, who was doing great up, up to that point. So, uh, yeah, so it's probably, yeah, that, probably that injury. It was, it unsettled us, unsettled yeah. us. And Harrison was doing great, doing really, really well. Um, so I feel feel sorry for him. Nasty injury as well, by the Well, I mean, it's obviously something to his arm. He, he just didn't feel well afterwards either. Yeah. So obviously, when you hyperextend a joint or something like that, you know, your body sends all these messages to your brain saying, yeah. you know, that's not normal. So he's probably getting the after effects of that. I think he'll be okay. Um, but yeah, we'll keep our fingers crossed. But yeah, that, that changed it. And then obviously goals change games. So they get a goal and then the momentum slightly changes a little bit. And yeah. then I was quite happy that half time came because it gave us a chance to uh, sort of kind of reorganise and, um, and explain how we wanted to go about second half. And, and the second half, we had to tough it out a bit. Yeah. So, and we showed we can do that too. So, you know, we, we defended a lot better. Um, and we, we rode our luck on a couple of occasions, but you know, once we got the third goal, the, the result was never in doubt. But um, and what a I'd third say, goal as well! Max really made. Yeah, I mean, pretty good goal goals today. Yeah, Max. Really Max I thought Max's goal the other day was terrific. Yeah. You know, I, you know, almost going away from goal to turn around and volley in yeah. from that angle was, was brilliant. So, look, you know, uh, two, two great performances with the results alongside but you know I'll reflect back on the first two games and us, us being here where we haven't played that badly mm. made mistakes and got punished yeah. and probably not been quite as ruthless uh, in front of the goal the other end um, and you know our points tally could have been even more but what we can, what I can say about the last four games is that everybody who's played has, has understood, understood the fact that we're changing things so the rotation of players in positions and all that sort of stuff and, and some on the bench and what have you They've accepted that. Okay, we've lost a couple along the way. Um, we've brought new players in, but 
everybody is playing for the shirt. You can see that. You they really are, can, and, yeah. Yeah, they're really working hard. Um, and you know, that's that's part of a culture of a, a, a football club that will, will hopefully go on and, and do well in, in the division next season. So, um, and we keep saying, as long as we see that, yeah. whether we win or lose, we're we're not worried at the moment because you know, there's no pressure on 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 the outcomes. But with the effort that they're putting in, sometimes they need the rewards. So I'm really pleased for them for the last couple of games. Yeah, it's shame there weren't more people to witness it today, really. But well, you know, the, I, I, the look, crowds listen, will come back, won't yeah, they? they will. Uh, they will. Um, you know, I can remember playing for Ashford. Yeah. Many, many moons ago, yeah, you know, yeah. we got promotion from the, uh, oh God, whatever league it was called back then, <laughs> I can't remember. But yeah, you know, Little Wasella Park, you know, probably only 100 odd people when we when I first started there. We got up to two, three, four hundred by the time we were we were looking to get promotion. I think the last game against Dorchester, there was nearly 1,400, 1,500 there. So, nil, nil. We, yeah, yeah, <laughs> we, we know we know that the, the fans will, will come back. But what they want to see is they want to see us playing football like we did first half, you know, attractive confident you know players not being frightened to express themselves um taking risks being brave on the ball yeah. um and you know that that's what we'd love to see i, I really enjoyed watching it yeah i thought robbie reese had a particularly good game today uh, well look, great, right? there's so many players that you could mention in yeah. there there were so many uh, players from the last game you could mention yes. but um yeah unbelievable and you know he was reluctant to. St I, I walked on it um, and said, "Look, can you can you do us a favour? Can you drop back in the left back?" And he was like, oh, "Okay, oh, I don't really want to, but I will." <laughs> and he, look, he didn't put a foot out of place, did he? No, like great. great covering round defensively at one point when they they went over, uh, and then obviously his forward play was um, was very good. So uh, there there are some advantages playing fullback, especially if you're a, an attack minded fullback. Yeah, yeah. Um, but uh, yeah, I'll have to convince him a little bit more about that. I think. <laughs> Yeah, well, well done. Thoroughly entertained. We enjoyed yeah, it. Yeah. Good. Sorry for people who didn't come. On on now to Sheppey. Another. Oh, now I'm looking forward game. to that game as well. Yeah, yeah. yeah. on a nice be, pitch. Be another great game. Should be a good yeah, game. Should it? be. Yeah. Well done. Cheers, boys. Thank Take you. Care.